What's going on guys and welcome back. We are now on episode 3 of The Last of Us Part 2. We've just had the um, romantic thing going on with Ellie and Dina in the uh, the little weed shop, um, <laughs> if we want to call it that. Uh, we've not met Joel and Tommy yet, but we are now back with Abby. So let's just jump straight into this and continue our adventure. And also please remember to like, subscribe and also leave a comment, even if it's just an emoji. It does help me out a lot. Um, a lot. So, let's jump into this. Okay. So, we're with Abby. And we can kind of see some Z's in the background. Did he just fall or something? Great. Infected. I wonder if we can sneak around here. I had to check then. I thought I wasn't recording. Not good. Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm just going to run this. I guess I wasn't meant to sneak. This is one way to start an episode. With cold toes. God, where am I going? Come on, move, 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 move. Nope, not that way. I missed something on that shelf. Nope, not today, not today, not today. Give me your hand. Oh. We're gonna have to run. Let's come on, you. I'll cover you. Let's go. Come on, this way. Who here? Oh, shit. Hold up. This way, come on. Well, she's met Joel and Tommy. It don't matter. What does is where we going? I reckon we go out the back. We can make a break for the lodge. Yeah, I ain't got a better idea. Hey, you got a gun? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I hope you're a good shot. Keep up with us. I want to see if I can warrior. grab anything. Come back with a cleanup crew. Ammunition or something. Gotta live through this first. Watch them windows. Or a pipe. I'll be needed. God damn it! These son of bitches are everywhere! Get to the door! I like how they're killing them. Another weapon? There is crowbar. Up there, the window. That's our way out. You see a way up there? Here, 
Use this! Hey, girl! Push it up onto the cart! Come, 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 come. We're getting inside! I'll get the gondola to the window! There's gonna be clickers. Oh, keep those infected! Okay! Watch it! Yep, there was a clicker. God damn it! Get this thing off of me! Help me with this thing! Holy shotgun! Shot I got him! Just keep those infected away! Watch out! Hurry! Uh, Run along! Uh, Just need another minute! Uh, okay! Okay! Uh, Sit with us! Uh, Jesus. I got it. Come on. Whoa, go. Hey, through the window. Let's go. Hurry. Bloody hell. I love the interactions with the uh, environment. Yeah, I got you. Get close to us. That was cool. Where are we going? It's this one. Come on. Everywhere. Don't slow down. There's a lot of them, so the door. it's the only option. Come on. Come on. He's shook. <laughs> Bloody hell. I feel like I can breathe now. That was just crazy from the get-go when I was 12 I found a skateboard uh oh and I tried to get on it <laughs> and it shot right out from underneath me <laughs> wait how did you get the scar I fell on my knife <laughs> Okay. Um, a chemical burn. Mm. I hate to hurt myself. Why? We know that's not true. Uh, to cover a bite mark? Right here? I got jumped by an infected when I was 14. And it turns out I'm immune. So it healed with a ring of fucked up teeth marks and cysts and- Ow! Fuck you. She doesn't well, believe her. Uh, hey. <laughs> I told you a real fucking story. I did tell you a real fucking story. Oh, you want a bite mark? What? Oh. Do you hear that? Jesse? Just stay there, okay? Are you just, okay? Just, will What's you wait, going on? please? What? Just turn around. What are you doing? Are you kidding me? 
You're supposed to be on patrol. There's a blizzard outside. Is that weed? <laughs> why are you here? People are counting on you, you get that? What we do matters. Well, then why aren't you at the fucking lookout? Because Tommy and Joel didn't show up. What do you mean? We waited for them for an hour. I was looking for their horses when I saw lights. Maybe they just went back to town. Without being replaced, no way. How much of their region have you covered? Not much. Then we split up. Go at it from different sides, and we can cover the whole thing in a few hours. I don't like you riding solo. We don't know what's out there. Exactly. What if they need help? Okay, I'll head west. Dina can take south, and you come from the east, but be smart about it, yeah? Yeah. I'm just reliving that moment when he just it, when he questioned then, was that weed? Is that weed? That made me chuckle a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Saddles off? No, no, it's all right. We'll just ride out the storm and get out of here. Oh, God, any brushes or towel or anything? You are nothing but lucky. And you have no idea. I don't get electricity in here. Where the fuck have you been? There are solar panels on the roof. And who are these people? How long y'all been here? Since yesterday. Yesterday? Yep. What are y'all doing out this way? I'm just passing through. You two live nearby? We do. A few hours down the hill. Y'all should come back with us, restock before we head out. Appreciate it. I'm Mel, by the way. Tommy. Oh, that's Mel. This is my brother. Joe. Y'all look like you heard of us or something. Because they have. Oh! <laughs> Oh no! Laura, all clear? He's out. Put him against the wall. Tommy! Get off me! Get off me! Say whatever speech you got rehearsed. Get this over with. Turn to get his leg. Do it. What the fuck? Holy fuck. 
clear out. What the actual fuck, man? Come on, Ellie. Need to bloody move. You're okay. You're okay. I honestly don't know what to say. See her screaming. Joel. What am I looking for? Fuck. Oh no. up outside. We didn't think anyone was going to show up. What the hell did you expect? We got to get out of here or the whole town's on top of us. You're done. You want what I want, right? End it. Now. Joel, get up. Joel, fucking get up. Please stop! Please don't shoot! Joel, please get up! No! 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 What the fuck just happened, man? Oh my god. Ellie? Ellie. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jesse! Oh, They're down fuck. here! Shit! What the fuck?
Well, I didn't see that coming. Sit down, please. Yeah. <sighs> Marie wants to make sure you're eating. Stop us. <clears throat> they have the guys that we would need to do this smart. We'd be leaving Jackson vulnerable. So they just get to get away with this? Nobody wants that. Yeah, but that's what's happening. What if we get hit by hunters again? Is this you talking or is this her? It's a valid point. If it were you or me, Joel would be halfway to Seattle already. No, he wouldn't. He absolutely fucking would be. Well, we don't even know for certain that they're from Seattle. Washington Liberation Front. That's what you said was on those patches. What if they stole those jackets? That's... What the WLF move? What are you doing? You know what? I'm leaving tomorrow. And if you want to come with me, great. You have no idea what you're walking into. You don't know how large that group is. How armed? I don't care. You can't talk me out of this. Give me a day to talk to Maria, okay? There's got to be some folks you can spare. And if she won't budge? <laughs> well, I'll figure something out. One day. Please. Holy crap. <laughs> she is going to hunt them down and kill every single one of them. I honestly can't believe that just happened. The adventures we went through with Joel, especially through the first one. He was the main playable character in the first one. Oh boy, imagine if they do this in the TV series. Why did she do it? 
how does she know? Like, she knows the name, but... I want to stop at his house before we leave. We just have to pick something up. I couldn't get to the horses. Looks like Tommy took one. Now Maria's got the stables locked down. <sighs> Fucking Tommy. We'll figure something else out on the way. A car or a horse or something. Okay. This makes getting to Seattle a lot harder. The, now this is a revenge mission. It's gonna be harder. That's gonna be the main objective. You can still change your mind, you know. Maybe we find out Maybe. why she did that. I just don't want you to feel like you have to. Ellie. You go. I go. End of story. You need to get your backpack. I hit it by the east gates. I figured we'd want to slip out that way. I, I think Tommy's going to allow her to go. I think I'm and Maria, uh, Maria. I think they're going to give him two horses. Oh, my God. Look at all the flowers. God, it's a bloody game as well. <laughs> I've never been so attached to a game. A storyline. If you have not played this... You 100% need to. I think it's a totally different experience. You get to watch it as... What do you need? I'll, I can go get it. A TV I'll show. Okay. I'm okay. I'll hang out down here. Thanks. Guess we gotta grab what we can grab. At least one thing now, though. Joel's with Sarah. His daughter, who sh who we lost in the very first, in the very beginning of episode uh, of uh, the first game. Even though it's been like what twenty four years, twenty five years. Put no description of it, I just kind of drew it. Oh, bloody hell. I want to know out of you people watching this, did it hit you guys in the fields? That was rough, man. Oh, the guitar. Is he making some? What is she write? All the promises at sundown. I meant them like the rest. Maybe she's taking inspiration just for, like, maybe making a song. Oh my God, look at them all. I suppose it's a hobby you've got to do in this type of life, right? When you've got nothing else to do, you have to kind of keep yourself occupied. These jackets. The iconic beige one. You gonna take it? Backpack. 
He's got this here. Oh yeah, those Sura. Looks like she's got an Argentina top on. I, rem I remember saying this with um, the the first game, and it's funny how we see that today. And Argentina literally won the World Cup today. Is there anything else we can do with that? Oh, he's watch. I would put it on if I was her. Uh, and his revolver. I think she kept... Wait, did she keep the watch? She didn't put it on, but she definitely took it. Oh. Was Everything that okay? Dina? Yeah. yeah. Just come on down. Oh, it's Miranda. Miranda. Maria. Maria. I'm headed to Seattle. I wish I could let it go, but I can't. I have to bring these people to justice. Ellie's gonna try to come after me, but stop her. Take her guns, lock up the horses, maybe lock her up. Buy me some time so I can end this. Tommy. Love you always, Tommy. Oh shit. He's gonna get himself killed. He should have taken me with him. You should have given us a group to go after those fuckers. I wish I could. You gotta try to lock me up? I'd prefer that you stay. That's not gonna fucking happen. I'd prefer that you stay, but I know you better. You going with her? Yeah. <laughs> so you're just gonna sneak out of here? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. On foot? I told the stable to let you out with your horse. Grab some ammo, too. Thank you, Maria. Just, uh, do me a favor and bring my dumbass husband home in one piece, please. Get going, you're you're losing light. This is one heavy episode, I'm not gonna lie to you. Abby, Abby, Abby. Seattle, day one. This hunter was on top of him, drowning him, and Joel couldn't get to his gun. Jeez. Were you scared? Well, I. Whoa. I didn't think. I just, I just ran in there, grabbed his gun, and shot the guy in the face. How old were you? Fourteen. How old were you when you first killed someone? Look how good this looks. No, fully conscious, non-fungal person. Ten. Wow. What happened? The guy was coming at my mom. I stabbed him. Shit. He got me beat. Yeah, I'm a real badass. 
So how lost are we? Uh, we're not. Uh-huh. Hey, have a little faith. I've never seen... What about those crazy cannibals you said you enjoyed? The forest so densible. They Dense. came after you guys once. Cannibals? Maybe these w oh, yeah, that's the first one. To them. No. It didn't seem like the same group. Maybe those black market smugglers back in Boston? Do you not? Joel crossed a lot of people. I don't see the point in guessing. Okay. At least until we find out more information. So, we've got Dino with us. And we're in Seattle. I don't know which way I'm going. I'm kind of winging it and just kind of following the flow of trees. All right, here we go. Some vehicles. Ellie, cars. Yeah, we're getting close. Start keeping an eye out. Got it. Oh. Here we go. Guess I was wrong. Turns out you do know where you're going. Now, this is some Walking Dead stuff. I'm not going to lie, it's making me want to... <laughs> I'm thinking about watching it now. Right from season one. Hey, right, what's in here? Traffic advisory, tune radio, 5.30 and when flash in Seattle only. Okay, we seems we can go in here. Let's have a look around. Stay with Shimmer. Yeah. Supplies, always good. Another card? The Starfire Kids trading card. Oh my god, what is this? Real names Emeru and Sori Hoshi. When 14 year old twins Emeru and Sori Hoshi found a meteorite in the woods outside Kyoto, touching into Ambude and other, uh, bo uh, and then both with the power of the Astro -kin Kinesis. The ability to take the starlight and turn it into energy, taken into custody by the Society of Champions, Tesseractor mentored the kids on how to use their power safely and wisely, though his overprotective nature eventually drove them away. Now they live in the streets trying to find meaning and purpose in their powers, and they are heroes. So we've already we've already come across, come across Tesseract, wasn't it? He? He's the the villain, the second card we picked up. The Brainiac guy. What's this? Oh, a map. Hmm. Interesting. Welcome to Seattle. Guessing this is going to be useful, right? I guess so. She took it. Anything good in there? Found an old tourist map. Well, that's something. It's better than nothing. All right, Shimmer, hold on. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. The way the legs, the, the horse's legs kind of maneuvered then kind of freaked me out a little bit. Seems quiet. Yeah. Think about how well we hide our lookouts. I know. 
That's what scares me. Consoles have come a long way because obviously I'm playing this on the PlayStation 5 and you know this this is visually insane. Especially when it comes to foliage. And I'm super interested in how Unreal Engine 5.1 is gonna perform with games now because foliage can now be used with the nanite technology that Unreal Engine brings. Oh, hello. Whoa, is that the QZ? Yep. Watch the high spots. What are we looking for here? There was a door to come in, but I took the uh, express route. Did I miss something here? Yeah, I did. A letter. I love finding these letters because it kind of gives you a bit of a understanding of what was going on here. Uh, when you get to the gate, look for a soldier named Kieran. Tell him I sent you, then give him the key law, and he'll get you inside the wall. Looks like there's some cracks up there. In the wall, up above. No, oh, we're going to have to climb. Just give me a minute. You just leave Shimmer. Anything good in there? Pretty picked over. Oh, what is this? Infected stage one, infected stage two, stage three. Infected stage one, Cordyceps has taken over the victim's motor functions. Fast and agile. Stage 1 infected usually travel in packs. Do not let them sworn you. Infected stage... Wait, didn't we talk about this last episode? How we were trying to figure out the stages of the infected. Use his environment, uh, environment to hide and ambush victims. Will frequently flank... These the the hiding ones. What we found in the sewers in the first game. It was kind of hidden around the corners and then jump out at you and attack. Watch with caution and check your surroundings. Infective stage three, completely blind, acute hearing. Use his echolocation to seek out prey. Keep your distance. Stage three infected are known for the ferocious attacks and extremely lethal. Obviously clickers. Stage four. Rare but dangerous evolution of stage three infected. Incredibly strong and capable of throwing acidic projectiles. Do not engage unless you absolutely necessary. They are... The first time we come across one of them was in the uh, on the basketball court in the gymnasium in the high school in the first game. That was a big boy. That's where we just got the shotgun as well. I was trying to take off his Those limbs kids. and holding cells. Soldiers had them in Boston too. Okay, I guess we need to figure a way to climb. Ladder there. Wait, can I... Maybe up here. Ah, over there. Okay. Never mind. Sorry, Dina. We're climbing over here instead. I think. Sounds like a bloody tennis match, this. A Wimbledon. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Do you not think? 
Athena, help me up here. Okay. All right, let's go. It's gonna be rickety. Use the upper strength. I'll keep an eye out. Just see if you can get the gate open from the other side. Sounds good. Oh God. Ooh. Here. Everything's fine. I think. Almost died. <laughs> almost died. I say that all the time. If I stumble, almost died. Well, there's no guards or anything. That's got me worried. I don't know if there was meant to be people here. Wait, am I going... Oh, oh wait, let me check up first. Wait, 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 Ellie, go back up. Let me check up here. There could be some goodies, and we love goodies. There is. And another card. Chess master trading card. Real name Caleb Sofors. After a running with multidimensional hero Tesseractor, Colonel Mastermind Caleb Sofor uh, suddenly could see every possible outcome of his decisions before he made one, naming himself Chess Master for his newfound ability to see dozens of moves ahead. This power came with a cost. Though he made a fortune helping other criminals plan the heist, seeing all possible outcomes crippled him with indec uh, indecision. Unable to utilize his power to enrich himself, he is forced to rely on others to make choices for him. Ooh. Go. Yeah, we don't want that. Oh, another uh, letter. Zelda. Zelda, once your unit's taken the gate, open it up and coordinate with John's units. We've got plants in the refuge line ready. I don't want uh, any Fedra survivors. As soon as you've got control of the area, offer the refugees entry in exchange for loyalty to the WLF. May you survive. Uh, may your survival be long, Isaac. Good. Right, now we can go down. There we go. Oof. That was a long drop. Okay. What is this? that to get inside we learned that last episode oh okay main gate I'm zero five one two north one three eight two east five three four five west six one two eight west zero four five please can, can, we, can we keep this
got a big operation coming up, and Isaac wants to use uh, use to scavenge any remaining supplies from downtown. Take any base. gas from the courthouse garage oh, at something. the dorm, and then take them safe house of the. Okay. Okay, we kept it. So I don't need to memorize or write them down at least. Okay. Now that's a generator. All right. Oh. Plug that in. Easy peasy. The cable, the cabling then kind of reminds me of Dying Light 2. How you have to plug one, well, one power line into another power line and you've got to kind of take it through stuff. I'm guessing that's going to be kind of some form of mini game within this. Nice. Hello? Password. Hey. Everything okay? What was that sound? I got that gate open. Gotta figure out this one now. Well, we believe in you. Thanks. You and Shimmer believe in me. Roger, Roger. I'll take a brick. Hmm. <laughs> you kind of see a peeping through the hole over there. I'm surprised that noise is not bringing any infected, to be honest. I'm just wondering if we've got to bring this cable over to this one. Because we don't need this gate unless this gate's going to shut now. No, okay, we're good. Yeah, because I'm not going to be able to take this around here, am I? Yeah, no. I'm going to have to take it over, I think. Can I... Yeah, it's kind of like the same mechanics as the um, the rope we had to climb up earlier. Her and Dina. Is it just going to connect? It does. Just. Just don't get clotheslined. Okay. Into passcord. Oh, um, how do we check this? Checkpoint gate codes, main gate zero five one two. Okay, zero five one two. Zero five one two. Yes. Nice. Enter. Well done. Hey, I thought I was coming down on the horse. Jesus. Right. Let's do this. Now what? I found a note back there. Had some codes on it. it. Says there's a WLF safe house at some place called Saravina Base. Saravina. So we find it? Hopefully we find our first WLF. Get them to talk. Go from there. Let's do it. Get East 2.
Oh shit, look. Saravina Hotel. Saravina Hotel. Just That's said that. It. <laughs> okay. Let's find a way past this uh gate. Fuck Fedra gate. <laughs> Very creative. It's right to the point. Let's get closer and scope it out. It's gonna need juice, isn't it? Do you know the code? That note I found has a bunch of them. We're gonna need power, obviously. We need to get power to the gate first. Yeah, it literally says need power. We've got cables here. Follow these. I'm guessing this generator is not going to be running. Okay, here we go. Out of fuel. Ah, it's out of gas. God damn it. Typical. Well, what do we do now? Look for gas. Oh, shit. The note. What? The note mentioned that there's gas in the courthouse garage and the dome. All right. Courthouse garage and the dome. So what's the plan for finding these places? We ride around and see what we see. You think Tommy came through here? But he did. Probably. Oh my god. I know they said it was a lot more open world now. So, where but... are we? Pretty sure... We're here. Ah, uh, nice. I'll mark it up as we go. <laughs> Fuck Fedrigate. Cool. Okay, so we've got quite a few things to explore. And we've got like a whole area to explore. That can wait till next time. Because this has been one roller coaster of an episode. Um, of emotions, I should say. So thanks for watching. Um, hopefully see you in episode four of The Last of Us playthrough. Keep smiling. As always, I appreciate you. And I'll see you in another video.